the best music. Oh, I'm a wine junkie. But anywho, welcome back, bougie beauties. We are back yet again with another YouTube video. In this video, I will be showing you guys how to slay them brows, honey, because them brows gotta be on fleek. Every bougie beauty should know how to get them brows together, sis. Look, the bougie beauty queen is here to help you get it all together. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and ring the notification bell below. And also, all the products will be listed below in the description link. Okay, Bougie Beauties, let's jump right on in. Okay, I'll be using this brow pencil from Wet n Wild, and it's in the color Dark Brown. Ladies, always make sure that you use a dark brown. Never use black. It's just not a good look, okay? You don't want your eyebrows to look like this. And what I really love about this brow pencil, it has a spoolie at the end. So it makes it easier to brush through the hairs. So now I'm just brushing those brows out. Getting those hairs to go the way that I need them to go. And you're going to start in the middle of the brow and do it very lightly. You're going to create your tail. Once you create your tail, you're going to move to the front and shade it in. Special thing about the brows, you want it no longer than the crease of your eye right there in the uh, beginning of the corner of your eye, um, brow. And remember, ladies, your brows are sisters, but they are not twin sisters, okay? So once you outline the brow, you are just going to lightly shade them in and take your time with it, ladies. It's okay. Now, whenever I get to the top, I like to get my brush and brush up with my liner. I do um, hair-like strokes. And don't worry if you mess up a little bit on your eyebrow. We're, we can always go back with concealer to fix um, your mistakes. So don't be so hard on yourself, okay? So now we have the outline. And what I'm doing is just going in and coloring it in. Like, you know, when you learn how to color inside the lines, that's what you're gonna do. And I'm brushing those hairs up with the spoolie and I'm continuing to make um, hair-like motions. It's very important, okay? And I'm showing you here at the tip of the um, eyeliner is sorta of at an angle, so I'm brushing up. Always brush up at the top, ladies. Okay, now I'm going to use um, a concealer by Kiss. I got it at my local beauty supply store for like $1.50. And it's in the color beige. Whenever you use your concealer, you want to make sure that it's a bit lighter than your um, natural skin tone. Because what it's going to do is make your eyebrows really pop. So now I am going to take the um, concealer and I'm starting at the middle once again. And I'm just literally outlining the outside um, of my inner corners of the eye. Eyebrow, I'm sorry. I'm just going really slow, taking my time. I know you can't tell because I had to speed it up, but... That's exactly what I'm doing. Now I'm going to get the brush and I'm going to brush that concealer down. So whenever you brush it down like that, it's going to make it easier to blend into the skin a little later on. Now 
So once you got it to the consistency that you would like it to be, and with your um, finger, you're going to get your finger and you're going to um, start to blend out those parts. So you see me here taking my finger and literally I'm just blending it. I'm rubbing out the access to erase um, that line so it doesn't look so, um, so like um, white, you know. So now for the top of the brow, I am going to go in with a darkened concealer. It's probably a shade darker than um, my highlighting concealer that I use for underneath the brow line. We're going to go above the brow and we're just going to clean up any excess. And it also makes the brow pop even more. It just makes it really stand out. And this is the part, say if you messed up a little bit, you can just literally use your um, concealer to fix it. No biggie. After this process, um, I normally let it sit and bake for a while. Because I always do my eyes first whenever I'm putting on makeup. So I normally just let it bake and I get a beauty blender and um, I blend it on out with the rest of my uh, foundation look. Say hi to Coop, you guys. I got bands and a Coop. That's my puppy Cooper. He just wanted to say hi to you guys. Well, I don't know if he wanted to say hi, but he wanted to say hi. Little puppy love. I love him. He's so cute. Okay, back to business. So we have one eye down, and now I'm on the second eyebrow. I've already um, drew them on, and now I'm just going in with my lighter concealer and the tone beige, and I'm concealing under those brows. Okay, Bougie Beauties, this is the final look. I hope you guys like this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Mwah! Thank you.